Hey, what's going on guys? How are your meatballs? In this video, I'll be showing you how to get a perkaholic every single perk in the game with a Modern Warfare 3 Zombies for free via each free perk Easter egg, the full correct guide. Here's a cheat sheet showing you where every single perk Easter egg on the map takes place for you to screenshot. And if more perks do get added in, which they probably will, I'll update the cheat sheet and make it available to you guys in my Discord instantly. You may now use the chapter time slots feature on YouTube to skip to each perk as needed. Death Perception. You simply make your way to this tower located at E1 coordinates. Climb up the main ladder at this tower and then loop around the catwalk to then climb up the second ladder that leads to the top of the tower. Directly across from the top of the tower, you'll see three rings. Your job is to jump off the tower and immediately deploy your parachute towards those three rings. Once there, fly through all three rings, just like I do here in the gameplay. If done correctly, when you land, a completion noise will play and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. Speed Cola. Make your way to the D2 coordinate of the map with a vehicle. With this vehicle, go up and off the top of the ramp. When you land, a completion noise will play and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. Juggernaut, make your way to the C3 coordinate of the map. Here, you'll find a campfire next to some chairs, and all you'll have to do is throw a Molotov onto the campfire. After, a completion noise will play, and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. Stamina, make your way to the D7 coordinate of the map. Here, you'll have to go into and run up the stairs of this building as fast as possible. It's also recommended to drop your weapon, this way you actually do run faster. You can always pick it up right after you're done. If you do this fast enough, a completion noise will play, and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. PhD, make your way to the H7 coordinate of the map. Head to the roof of this mansion and then make your way onto this wood scaffolding. Your job is to run and jump off this wood into the pool successfully. A tip would be to drop your weapon temporarily and stand between these two pieces of wood. That's where I've had the highest success rate. It may take you a few tries, but when done right, a completion noise will play and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. Quick revive. Make your way to the I-5 coordinate of the map with either the two-wheeler ether motorcycle or the four-wheeler ATV slash quad. No other vehicle will work. Go into the vehicle under the bunny on the sign as you can see in my footage. Wait for this laugh. If you don't hear the laugh, get out of the vehicle and go back in and wait for it to laugh. Also, do make sure that again you are lined up properly right underneath the post. Also, don't let the zombies destroy the vehicle, you need it. But yeah, once you hear the proper laugh, hold down the try button and race directly to and through the other sign with the other bunny. This can be really quick or it actually could be weird and take you an entire game to do for some reason because of the need for near perfection. But when done right, a completion noise will play and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. Deadshot Daiquiri. Make your way to the I-3 coordinate of the map. You need either a frag or a semtex grenade. Successfully throw the grenade through this window with the goal of making the grenade detonate as soon as it gets through. Also, if you do happen to fail, there is an ammo cache right next to you, which you can use to then refill those grenades. Once you properly get the grenade through the window, a completion noise will play and inside the spawn portal will be your free perk. Tombstone. Make your way to the G7 coordinate of the map with a sniper. You can either spawn into the map with one, which I prefer and recommend, or you can loot one. Stand on the roof of this building and look across the map towards this crane. On it, you'll see the blue ether bunny. Your job is to aim down sights with the sniper for as long as possible until the ether bunny jump scares you. When done, a completion noise will play and inside the spawn portal will be your perk. Elemental pop. Make your way to the E4 coordinate of the map. Be careful because it is in the red zone. You will not survive unless you run with only your fist out. Also, this easter egg is actually tied to another easter egg which allows you to carry over weapons to your next game. If you want more information on that, stay tuned to my channel. But anyways, at this zone, go up to this grave and interact to pay respects. It will strip you of your weapon rarity, ammo mods, and pack-a-punch, so keep that in mind. Yes, you'll still have your weapon, but none of the stuff on it. After that's done, inside the spawn portal will be a 30% chance of your perk. Unlike the other free perk easter eggs in the game, it is not guaranteed that you get a perk from doing the free perk easter egg because it's tied to another easter egg, but if you do get a free perk, it will always be elemental pop. Like if it helped you out, and take care of your meatballs.